In this video, I'm going to show you how to turn an internal hard drive like this into an external drive you can use on your computer or gaming console. And this hard drive enclosure from Orico makes it easy to do. I have a 1TB Samsung SSD lying around, so that's what I'll use today. But the Orico enclosure will work with traditional spinning hard drives as well. However, they do have to be a SATA hard drive. Here's how it works. The Orico enclosure simply slides open, which is the reason why I chose this particular case. To install a drive, find the end with the connection ports and then just slip it into the SATA plug in the enclosure. The best part is that I don't need any tools to do this. And because the case is clear, I can easily tell which hard drive I have inside. Then all I have to do is connect the included USB cable and this is ready to go. The Orico hard drive enclosure is USB 3 compatible, which means I'll get faster transfer speeds on USB 3 computers and gaming consoles. Swapping out hard drives is easy. Just lightly lift the end of the drive up and pull straight back. Here I'll install an old traditional 2.5 inch drive so you can see that it also fits. If necessary, remove any brackets that might be attached. Just remember that the Orico enclosure only works with 2.5 inch SATA hard drives. So I can use this case on drives I pulled out from old laptops. And because I don't need any tools, I can swap them out easily. The Orico external hard drive enclosure is only $15, and it's definitely handy to have around. I've listed it in the description so it's easy for you to find. And here are some final notes about this setup. With most hard drives, they're already formatted for PC, which means they're ready to go if you're a Windows user. But if you're on a Mac, there's almost 100% possibility that you'll have to format the raw drive to Mac OS first before you can use it. So keep that in mind. But I really like that I can use any 2.5 inch SATA drive up to 4 terabytes. And without the need for tools, I can easily change out with any compatible hard drives I have lying around. If this video was helpful, please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button to stay up to date on all my weekly videos.